two speedies and two slowies, Sonic music in the background, it's perfect. But at the end of the day, we have four fatties on the screen. That's what matters. Dude, it's so true. Everyone, like, people have to really be going for Gibbs here because all these characters are going to live to absurd percents just based on weight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I definitely feel like the game plan for the blue team is, you know, trying to kill them at low, lower percents because... You know, it's a, it's a gimping team. It's double DDD, yeah, right? Just like, whereas... Ooh, whoa, okay. Talk about some win boxes. That's curtains for Dutchman's first stock. Mm -hmm. And the red team actually has really strong kill moves. Um, mm -hmm. Me and Charizard 4, to name a few, uh, Fly. There's some good moves out there to kill Merle. <gasps> oh, oh, my God. What a combination. Talk about some team synergy. This shit was nuts. This is the first time they're playing together. <laughs> I know. What is this? Looking super natural. And, like... We don't have a whole lot of Charizards out in the state. We don't have a lot of doubles tournaments out here in yeah, Arizona, right? period. Like, I'm, I'm surprised he was so ready to capitalize on that. And there he goes. Dude, okay, so here they go. Red team taking a lead right now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. So uh, right now, they just have such good stage control. Like, they're really using their speed to their advantage here. Mm -hmm. and Dutchman, like, I'm surprised he's doing so well because I know he hasn't been out to add, like anything lately. Yeah. I know in his last tournament, he was really feeling the rest. Mm -hmm. You know, he's looking clean for the most yeah, part. Yeah, for sure. Oh, he doesn't have a jump anymore. See, normally at yeah, that point dead. is where uh, Bean Dips, his normal uh, doubles partner, Zero Suit Samus Main, would come in and do a down air, and Charizard would be oh, fine. Yeah. But uh, Falcon really doesn't have the capability to pull off those kinds of plays. Mm -hmm. Speaking of plays. He's got a few, but they're all pretty on the risky side. Yeah. He's got to go out there. Exactly, um, and you and don't like want to go out there. Yeah, yeah, you don't want to go out there. Especially against double DPs. Yeah, like, you're just asking for death. There we go. Dutchman at early stock. What's this the confirm? Is okay, there we Oh, that waddle. That was a good save. Super smart. But this is very much in red team's favor. This yeah. Red stock count because they're about to lose two. And there we go. A whole stock up. Oh, man. Wow. Who, who would have seen this coming? And uh, yeah, um, if, if you're in depth right now, you might <laughs> you might be worried about your future in this team. <laughs> <laughs> Same with GB7. GB7, man. I, uh, I forgot about him. Yeah, because... Uh, no, I assumed Cobra would have been teaming with Neon, who I don't see in the building, and that's what happened. Really? Because I haven't seen GB7 since him and Cobra got wrecked in some random cyber zone. Ooh, okay. Oh, and that's a quick switch. Suddenly. See, this is the crazy thing about doubles. With two characters, there's so many possibilities for things to happen mm -hmm. all over the screen at the same time. Yeah. Momentum can shift incredibly quickly. Yes, of course. And how are they going to deal with that? I mean, they look pretty composed. They got center yeah. stage. The Cobra's They're still punishing really, really well. Still. Yeah. He Sad. almost got clipped up with yeah. that down air. That would have been real bad. <laughs> All right. Nice save from Dutchman. That's oh, he going. should be dead. No. Yeah, Dutchman didn't charge the down B. I don't think. Yeah. I think maybe he like missed an input window or something. Mm -hmm. or like, did it too early. It, it looked like he hesitated. Yeah. I think he, I think he thought he had He's it. like, do I have enough of a window that Jesus won't come and like destroy me? Oh, Whoa! What? what the? I've never seen that before. Um. All right. <laughs> Knockback angles, physics, you know, uh, those are things we have here in Super Smash Bros. Project M. I hope somebody odd shots that so I can Yeah, I, can I need to again. I need to see what, what what exactly just occurred. He definitely just like hit him on the ledge. Yeah, the very ledge. Him. He was because uh, it looked like Charizard landed on stage, but D didn't, but they still hit that like invisible floor. It was strange. I'm definitely gonna have to mm -hmm. And this is a rough situation to be in, but it's very much doable. There we go. There's I one. say it would be doable if it wasn't Hisus. I don't know. I, I'm not gonna say I believe, but I can see it. All he needs is either he's dead. He's so dead. It's, <laughs> it's over. It's super over. All he needs is a <laughs> fresh four stocks on the new game because that's not gonna happen this time. And uh, blue team takes a 1-0 lead. Yeah. Um, it's definitely like I could see this not being a 3-0. Easy. Oh yeah, yeah. That, you know what? They they convinced me when I first saw that they upset the teams that they did. Oh, yeah. I was kind of like, you know what? Maybe it was luck. Um, it was. It's, it's both of our Arizona signature, like, doubles gods. We have Dutchman, who's always been a signature carry, and then the Cyberzone, like, secret hit squad of doubles is 6X and Ande, Pair of Brothers, Falcon, mm -hmm. Luigi. And I was just like, you know what? Maybe it was a one-time thing, but I'm sold. I think they earned it. Yeah. I mean, a win's a win. Yeah. It is? No, okay, so uh, the I'm team, convinced. the Dutchman and Cobra B, that was uh, Venom and Arrow. Venom and Arrow, yes. Which is crazy. That is a good team. Weren't they seeded number one? Yes. Uh, Dutch and Cobra were eight seeded. Hmm. No. Let's see what they're doing out here. Where, where do you want to see them go? Hmm. That's really hard, because, like, 
You definitely want to have space to exert your speed advantage. I think Stadium is a good spick like for that because you still have the low ceilings yeah. for Charizard to get his early kills. <laughs> early. Early. You know, I mean, early is a relative term. Yeah. We're, we're talking about double DD. As early as possible against double DD. Exactly. And this should be a good opportunity to get some damage on Fix Me. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> you mean Ripple? <laughs> <laughs> Dutchman looking he really looked, ready he for this really matchup. <laughs> he, he took a jump. And then he was like, okay, yeah, I'm you in a pretty good position. And he just took it all away. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, that's a no glide equals dead dragon. Yeah. Uh, he tried to do something neat with a, with a, I forget what it's called. It's the side B. Yeah, glide. Uh, no, th that's down B. Oh, no, no. Uh, oh, you're right. Yeah. You mean with the, the flame breath thing yeah, the, of doom. With that move, there he, oh, I think a B might have killed there. But if you hold the direction of like that Charizard is facing away, you can get some momentum behind. So he mm -hmm. tried to like space himself and then glide. Uh, okay. But he just got yeah, clipped on the glide. There. Yeah. Good awareness on that by Manny. Oh, and this should be a good opportunity now. He doesn't capitalize on it. Yeah, DD was uh, absolutely not hit stun still. Yeah. It's really weird seeing how much synergy these guys have, considering it, it's it DD. You wouldn't think DD would be able to like combo off of himself very well, but uh, they make it work. Mm -hmm. And. Yeah, that team should have an advantage yeah. here. It should be two easy edge guys. Two stocks. Yeah. yeah. Off the top of that Charizard. Yeah, I think this is the absolute worst case scenario where we have both of the red team stages. See, red the thing team is, characters just off stage. The reason I think they were able to do so well all the way up into the last moments of that mm -hmm. first game is that they were maintaining their lead. Mm -hmm. Right now, both these characters have to try to run an approach a pair of DDDs. Yeah. And that's a situation DD wants to have you in. Like, if DD is forced to have to try and come back on you, that's not good for blue team, mm -hmm. but... Yeah, it's... This matchup, probably more than a, a lot of them, can be really dictated by how well you can hold center stage, because mm -hmm. approaching DDD is not fun, and DDD approaching is even worse. Yes. So if you can make the other person come to you while they're trying Ooh, to rejoin okay. their teammate... That's going to make a big difference, and there we go. Dude, he's so good with those instant ledge grabs. Dutchman not showing any rust right now. And if Dutchman can hold on to this stock for a little bit more, they can work on building on building. Exactly. If he can just keep Jesus distracted with this edge guard scenario, Cobra was able to rack up a bit of damage on, uh, on Dumb Shiny. Yeah. There goes that Charizard stock. Falcon is pretty good at comboing DVD. Oh, <laughs> he can do it pretty, most pretty everybody, good. But... And you're the gonna thing is, you're going to see some big numbers coming out of it. Yeah. And since Falcon's so good at killing horizontally, he doesn't really have to worry about uh Oh, DDs. he gets a taunt there. He tried to... Yeah. Um, he I went mean, for I, the knee taunt. Yeah, he went for a knee taunt and didn't get knee. <laughs> Landed and got a taunt. That's nuts. Don't do not do that. <laughs> Option selects are uh, not your friend in this situation. <laughs> oh, good movement by Dutch there. Sybe might have connected. Ah. Uh, should be fine. Overextended a little tiny bit, but he's all right. Just need to okay. Go there. there we go. Suddenly, and red this team is they, looking really good. They have to protect Dutchman. Yeah, Charizard has to be behind. That's fine. That's basically. And you don't want to approach him there. Not yeah. at the ledge. No, no. Fall back. Fal Falcon should be center stage, but uh, Starzard also needs to be center stage right now because of his percentage. It's a hard, hard call. Ooh, pressures on Cobra. See what he can do here. Okay. And he's playing it pretty safe. He doesn't want to take any risks here. Don't go to the ledge. What are you doing? Calls his jump in. And that was a good rollback. Mm -hmm. he, he knew that it was much more of a commitment to try oh and follow God. him on the ledge there. Dumb Shiny's got possession of this entire stage right now. Oh, Cobra with the Hail Mary. Out? Oh, this could be... Oh, he misses it. Okay. That's it. That doesn't look good. Oh, oh wow. He, he managed to get away with it's it. It's fine. It's fine. He's dead. <laughs> Reversal of Fortune. Blue team staying in the game. He's able to clutch that. That's really good presence of mind because... Not only was he behind from the get-go, he started off getting comboed. He yeah, was at, exactly. It was like 70 to 9. Um, but he brought it back nicely. Maintain his composure. Mm -hmm. Definitely not getting flustered by the uh, the speed difference there. Yeah, and hopefully Cobra doesn't go until he's shaking his head. I don't like that. Come on. Oh, that's that's Cobra's. Uh, I know. Number one personality trait. Yep. <laughs> Which is why I'm hoping you like he stays <laughs> in it. I don't. 
they've been playing really well. It's getting closer each time. Just I stay calm. I definitely think this stage is a good option for them. Mm -hmm. Going back, I agree with 100%. Yeah. I mean, I don't think it was a position where they should have lost in the first place. Yeah. It was just a mistake. Wow. That is a very dead Charizard. I don't even think he needed the second forward air, to be honest. Absolutely not. Oh, there we go. Nice save, save by Dutchman. That's why he's the doubles king of Arizona. <laughs> that jab hitbox. <laughs> it's a good move. A bit of a commitment, but it is a very good you move. You can definitely cover options with it. Mm -hmm. And Charizard's forward throw is actually really underrated. It goes really fast, and if you're not expecting it, it yeah. throws pretty far out. Ooh, triple bear? Went for the greedy fair at the end, but it doesn't matter. He gets the kill. Didn't even get that killed should off that punish. Not do it. For a second, I thought he had dumb shiny. Nah. <laughs> he had to like pause, glance at the percent, glance back at the DDD. All right. Okay. That's enough. Man, Cobra is just getting manhandled right now. Mm -hmm. mm. Dutch manages to make it back high. Yeah. Oh, not on stage for too long though. This is dangerous. Has nothing but yep, the upbeat. Yeah. Try to go for the glide trick, for the side B trick again there, but just not a whole lot he could do. Blue team's looking pretty good this time. This is a very solid lead. And unlike a lot of characters, this is not a team that easy to Yeah, you get can't back really on. expect to do a lot of gimping against team uh, team double D D D D D sixty. Yeah. You know what? They got two off of Dumb Shiny, and uh, if they can force him to take stocks from Pacers, exactly, it could go a long way. Ooh, okay, not enough, just a little meteor. Cobra went for that spike, but uh, the upward hitbox on DB's up B is surprisingly good. It's really good. You really want to be trying to hit him on that return down. Obviously, that wasn't an option in that situation, but boom! <laughs> Another pair of stocks down for red team. And this looks like this might be now. it, yeah. yeah. Desperation down smash. They gotta go uh, get sent back down to the shark pool of losers bracket. And Maybe I'm actually get, gets a run back with SoCal, yeah. I actually really like that because they've been doing it since they they played us, mm -hmm. which is they inhaled one DDD so they can shoot them out and mm -hmm. then they don't have to approach us. DDD. Exactly, because the DDD is already there. You're coming in with a hitbox, <laughs> and then uh, as soon as you pop out, you just snare, and then mm -hmm. you have another. <laughs> so it's a it's a neat trick. It just takes a while to set up. Yeah, that's the weakness of it. They usually have that kind of space. Yeah. People don't want to really approach you that that much. And this is... Let's see what kind of show they have to put on yeah. for us. Once you're stuck between... Oh, my Judy God. You're <laughs> a Diggly on the Legend, a Diggly one character yeah. length above. It's like, yeah, you know what? You guys got me. Just take it. Once you're stuck between two DDDs, you're just... You're dead. Yeah. Like, you may not die right away, but there's absolutely very little you can do. Um... DDD's not bad attack chasing by himself, and there's another one covering half the stage. So it's scary, for sure. Who do we got next? I'm assuming the other side of winner's semis, which is Ande and Six AX versus Deadpool and Isla Bagels. Okay. So AZ's number one Luigi versus AZ's number two Luigi. Cool. And then we've got uh, Deadpool, of course. Uh, whatever character he feels like playing this afternoon. Mm -hmm. And then Ande, another Falcon. In case you guys were fans of uh, the Captain. Okay. Ande and 6AX are a pair of brothers, frequent cybers yeah, and regulars. Yeah. Uh, really good team synergy. It's just freaky good. Just must be a, a sibling thing. Yeah. I mean, they probably play a lot together. Well, of course. Um, you think they have a chance to beat Bagels in that pool, or, or is that looking good? Um, it honestly depends on how Dadpool's playing today. Mm -hmm. I know sometimes like he just has off days, primarily in doubles, but mm -hmm. we'll see how it goes. Cool. Yeah, I, I know Andy and 6IX. Um, I haven't seen a whole lot of their play. Uh, I think I've seen a couple of matches from both of them. Never in doubles. Oh, doubles is definitely like where you need where to look out for these guys. Yeah. yeah. So I, I'm interested to see what, what they bring out. Okay, let's so, hmm. Currently have a Sheik on there. Yeah, that, if I'm guessing, it's going to be Deadpool's Sheik and Bagels' okay. Falcon. Hopefully, they don't stick with it if they. <laughs> um, They're both solid characters, but well, yeah, nowhere near. Sure. And I mean, nowhere. <laughs>